night, when you're in a bad position, um, you know, if the guy's really slick, he's probably going to take you back or do something here. But again, we're, 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 worst case scenario, we're probably getting out. We're going to get out of a bad position to mount and we're going to be head to head. Um, so the last one we're going to do for entry is a shin to shin. Now this correlates really well um, with getting into any sort of heel hook, foot lock or any entanglement. Really good for sweeps, uh, all that kind of stuff. Um, so I've got Garnet, he's just going to have his left knee to the ground and he's got his right leg up. Then we get an inside hook and I'm going to bowling ball grip behind his knee here. I'm going to keep my elbow on the inside. There's a million different ways of doing it. You know, some people like hugging and going for it and all that kind of stuff. Um, but I like getting that little bit of distance and framing because it gives me room to be able to move. If I start hugging, it just drives me in. And it starts putting me in all sorts of trouble. Like, we can work with it, but we're going for the entry that we want. This little bit of separation can give you the room that you need to move and play with it. Especially if you start trying to knee slide through and then I'm going to get my angle and I'm underneath you. So what we're trying to do is we're getting our inside hook. We've got a shin to shin guard. I've got my bowling ball grip where I'm just hugging onto the back here. And what I'm going to do is I would prefer to keep his leg, to keep his base um, as minimal as possible. Obviously you start basing out and all that kind of stuff, it's going to present problems with giving room to move. But for now I'm just going to push my hand on the inside to give me the direction that I want to roll. I don't want to fall back. I'm going to fall to my side. As I fall to my side, my left foot is going to snake on the inside and it's going to stomp on his hip. And I'm going to get straight to my, my single leg. A huge stomp on the heel and I'm squeezing my hips here. Shin to shin. I'm nice and supported here and strong. I can ride it, I can frame away from him. I can do what I need to. I'm going to fall to my side. I'm pushing on the inside of his knee. This foot is going to snake all the way up, and then I'm shooting my hips up, and I'm attacking that single leg next. I've trapped his knee line, I've got his foot where I want, and I've got a million different options to start attacking legs. Cool. Any questions? Sure.